Healing takes time. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. All of us need time to heal. All of us go through struggles. We all go through pain. And not every person experiences that pain the same way. And after that struggle has passed, not all of us heal the same way. So immediately the way that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created us is that each of us need time. Even the best of his creation, the Prophet والسلام, needed time to heal. That's why at the end of Surah Al-Hijr, Allah Azzawajal told his messenger والسلام, when he was going through a real difficult time, the Meccans were always persecuting him. They were always making fun of him. They always stood against him. They called his message a propaganda. They called him a magician. They called him all sorts of names. So the Prophet والسلام, felt really hurt and down by all of this. Allah then tells him, فَسَبِّحْ بِحَمْدِ رَبِّكْ وَكُمْ مِنَ السَّاجِدِينَ وَعَبُدُ رَبَّكْ حَتَّى يَأْتِيَكَ الْيَقِينَ So listen to the step-by-step -step guide that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives him on how to heal, how to develop the strength, the focus that he's going to need to continue to move forward. The first thing Allah says to him is make tasbih of Allah. Tasbih is when you glorify and praise Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You glorify His authority. The second thing, Allah tells him to take full advantage of sujood. So be amongst those who are constantly prostrating. Why is that? That's the closest we are to Him subhanahu wa ta'ala. Again, all of this takes time. You'll have to look at your schedule. You'll have to put aside everything and just concentrate on whatever difficulty you're going through. Pour your heart out to Him, subhanahu wa ta'ala, especially in the sajda. And the last thing that Allah tells him, continue to worship your master until the time of certainty arrives, meaning until death. So this is the kind of life that we're all hoping for that we remain close to Allah, that we always pour our heart out to Allah, and as a result, Allah gives us the tools and the strength that we need to cope with all of the difficulties and challenges in life. This is why healing takes time. And as long as we are here, we will always have that time, that opportunity, inshaAllah ta'ala, especially in this beautiful month of Ramadan. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us strength. Allahumma amin.